guys, this video is only for people that are serious about growing a gaming channel. Just a gaming channel, not exactly a normal channel, like a vlog channel, just a normal gaming channel. So the people that want to do that, this video is for you. So how to grow a gaming channel in 2020, here are a few tips. Pick what game you want to play. So there is this kind of like YouTube analytics thing where if you go to the gaming section of YouTube, you can see how many views that certain game gets. Now pick at least two games in there that catch your eye, or at least one game. I picked two and that was GTA and Fortnite. Fortnite had like 99 million or 99 billion views when I checked. It had a buttload of views, alright? So many people were watching live streams of Fortnite. I'm pretty sure like League of Legends is number one and Better Free Fire is like number three. GTA 5 was number four, I believe. Number three or four. So I decided to pick GTA and Fortnite. Specific reason is, well they were the most popular games that I actually had. And all the other games, I didn't really have. Like I had all these sick games. And GTA was the only one that actually caught my eye because of how many because of how much people were watching it and actually playing it. So pick at least one game that catches your eye and has a lot of views. Because the people that are going to click on that are going to think, hey, that game's getting a lot of views. Maybe I should watch it. Because since it's getting a lot of views, I see I should watch it. Because, you know, it's just us. And then they click on that and then they see your live stream. They actually have a high chance of clicking on that. Number two for gaming would have to be live streaming. So if you want to go to a gaming channel, you definitely want to live stream at least once per week. You can live stream every single day. So, here's the thing. Live streaming every single week will get you about 1,000 to 100,000. No, 100 to 100,000 views. If you live stream every week. If you live stream every single day, it's going to get you predicted two hundred thousand views to one million views if you live stream every day but most people live stream every sunday so more kids can watch it now i understand why people do that but why do i think that's a bad idea it's just a bad idea for views and if you're serious about growing your YouTube channel, do not do that. And I can see to do the racing course person. So my number three is to consistently upload. So consistently uploading is key. 
So I talked about this in a few videos ago on how consistently uploading is the best way to get views or subscribers. Because more people are probably going to, you know, watch consistently uploads consistency is actually key to actually people watching you on YouTube because if you upload every single month Uploading is actually key guys. If you want a nice growing YouTube channel that will stay on the tubes for a while. Subscribers is not. Subscribers are 
not as important as watch time. So once you reach about 50 subscribers, you're getting pretty close to 100, you want to start making videos about 10 minutes. If you only have like 40 or 10 subscribers, make your videos like 5 minutes. Or at least five minutes. Growing your YouTube channel is not too hard as it seems if you're a gamer. Although gaming videos are the hardest to grow, they won't be after this video. I can see it to do the race backwards. And I suck at doing it because once this stunt comes up, I just don't even have to. Oh, flip. Flip my life. So I hate my life right now. So since growing your YouTube channel will be fast, 50 subscribers is when you want to start making your videos about 10 minutes. Or longer. Or like five minutes or longer. Now if you don't have that many subscribers or that many viewers, you might actually, you're gonna get more subscribers as you go on and as you proceed to make videos. As you proceed to make videos and as you get more subscribers the easier it's going to get to get more subscribers because more people are going to be coming to your channel and more people will be finding out about your channel. Now growing a YouTube channel in 2020 is not that hard. All you have to do If you guys are a, if you guys wanna fully you grow your YouTube channel, need to grow your YouTube channel fast and quick. Growing your YouTube channel fast is actually the hardest one ever. Being able to actually make YouTube videos is key to actually being able to get a lot more subscribers. 
getting more subscribers equals more watch time and you need 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours to become a YouTube partner. And to be a full-time YouTuber. And if you guys don't know how to monetize, I'll make a video about that when I reach about 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. But right now, I'm just teaching you how to get 100 subscribers if you're a gaming channel. Set small, set small goals. Like, set your goal for like 10, and then set your goal for 50. And set your goal for 100. Like, it's not that hard. Growing a actual YouTube channel, like a business YouTube channel, to manage your business. It's even easier to grow. Since you do need a thousand subscribers to monetize, get a thousand. But then from now on, you guys will be able to grow your YouTube channel just by using these tips. Or at least a gaming channel. So pick which game you want to play and make sure that game has like the most views. So if you want to play Minecraft but Fortnite has the most views, I'd recommend doing videos on Fortnite. If you want to play Minecraft but no, if you want to play Fortnite but Minecraft has the most views, do videos on Minecraft. If you can't afford Minecraft, then do Fortnite. Fortnite zero dollars, so yeah, you should be able to easily do that. I only stick to Fortnite and GTA videos now, so yeah. By using these tips, you can see that my YouTube channel is growing, and now your YouTube channel is about to grow. So, bye guys.